Hello and welcome back to the Grinkle Snatch channel where we are playing Fallout 4, I believe this is part 19, where we're continuing our playthrough of kind of walking around the wasteland and finding new areas that I may not have discovered before. Uh, it's your boy Austin, just back at it again, um, but I was looking through my old videos because I <laughs> honestly, for some reason, I couldn't quite remember why I was back here again, but then I remembered that I just have so many places to discover over here that I need to avoid this kind of enclave checkpoint and then kind of, you know, discover things and figure stuff out. Now, we have a factory over here that you can see pretty clearly through the brush and we might even go there first um, because I was considering what looks like a hospital over in this direction, but I think we might head over here just because it's so close. Now, in I think it was part 17 of Fallout where there was a bunch of enemies out here fighting each other and I think it's just a random event that occurs depending on the save. Um, I'm only saying that because I was hoping that they weren't here now and it looks like... Oh wait. What the? I see. <clears throat> so, there's only this guy I guess and he died with one bullet. Oh nope, there... Oh, nope, okay. Alright, well... I, okay, I don't, I, this man's coming at me hard and fast, and, uh, can I injure people's, like, individual, I can, in, I, I can do limbs, yeah, so let's, I wonder if it'll help if I, uh, if I hurt his arm. Let's do a critical! Oh, hell yeah. Now, I, I, th I think there was footage that, uh oh, I think there was footage that I, oh my god, why are you guys so strong? Anyway, there was footage that I deleted that you guys haven't seen of me getting absolutely fucking murdered by these guys because I was trying to um, check out the Enclave checkpoint and they kept running at me and killing me. And it was a... Oh my god, there he is. And it was the most frustrating thing. Where are you, buddy? All right. Yeah, it was the most frustrating thing ever, and I hated it, and uh, so I kept, I stopped going over there, but for some reason I felt right now that I was strong enough uh, to go over here, um, which I probably am, just dependent on how I handle the situation. Yeah. Get that fucking, I'll take the flamer. Uh, um, is cage armor? Is that better than what I'm wearing right now? Look, I know we're mid-fight, but like, come on, if I found something better, 24, no, it's not. We'll drop it. Yeah, we don't need it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Jesus Christ. you think I'd be a little bit more attentive to that, but those, uh, those Molotovs came really fucking quick. All right, I'm probably going to go over here... One more time, but I'm, I'm going to skip the fight. So hopefully, in a moment, you'll see me in an area full of corpses. Uh, so give me just a second. All right, we successfully got through all the enemies out here, and it did take a, a hell of a time to do it. As you can see, my, my health is actually pretty low. But let's just pop one of my stim packs. Maybe two stim packs. Make sure I'm good. Because... I have a feeling that even though, based on where this area is located, I should be able to handle it, but it just doesn't feel like I'm going to be able to. At least... Hello? Wait, Saugus Ironworks? Wait, why is there a suicider? What is going on? Jesus Christ! What is happening right now? Oh my goodness. Wow. Are they dead? Jesus Christ. All right, this is a this is a problem. I did not think we were going to walk over here and get messed up like this this bad. Um I guess this? <laughs> I don't know. I just th there's a legendary super mutant enforcer over there and uh Wow. I can take care of the normal super mutants fine. It's the it's the legendary one that I'm worried about. Let me go over here and hide behind this for a second, and we're going to do a quick save. Yeah, there he is. 
Thankfully, I guess my gun can light him on fire, and if, if laser weapons could always do that, I had no idea. Hello? Oh my goodness. The amount of shit that is popping off. Let's see if we can pop this guy, because he... <laughs> Look, I just, I just want to explore. I, that's all I want to do. Look, fighting in this game is fun and all, but like... Come on. We're probably going to have to use another stim pack and maybe some rad away. Let's do rad away, a little bit of rad X. I'm a little bit thirsty. Have some water and a stim pack. For some reason, he thinks hiding behind a, a wire fence like this is going to protect him. All right, get past this mutated phase. I apologize, this is going to take a second, just because... Oh my god, he shot me right in the goddamn head. This is only taking a second because... I, <clears throat> I know I've said it a hundred times and y'all are probably tired of it. I am not strong enough to be going against people like this. Um, and I keep talking about playing story missions and shit, but I, just, I keep not doing it. Because I just think it's... It's more fun just to walk around and like kind of discover areas like this. But let's see what he dropped. Plasma infused powerful what? Hunting rifle. Add 10 points of damage and can turn enemies into goo. Huh. We'll take that. Ooh, super mutant orders. I'll take that too. Night vision pipe sniper rifle. I'll take that too. But why? What do you mean super mutant orders? Let me see. I'm curious. Why, why'd they get sent this way? Did I do something? What does this say? Kill, loot, return. Alright, so, uh... They're just dumb. That's all it is. They're just dumb. As expected. I expect nothing less out of a super mutant. But, anyway... Let's continue our search. So, we were in here. That's, Nuka uh, that's my Nuka Cola. I actually left that there. Um, we'll come through here. Um, I don't see... Take a little pre-war money. Take the cram. There's some food stuff. I guess I'll take it in case your boy needs it. And we have the act... Did someone else hear? Yeah, as you can see, live and in stereo, this is the thumbnail of the video. I hope you enjoy. Um, let's go in here... Who is talking? There's so many people around me right now. We have a half-lit cigarette. We got some dirty water. Anything good in here? Medex, I'll take it. So there's people above me on the roof of this building. That's for sure. And Lord knows that the weapons that I have may or may not be good enough to get through this area. I'll go ahead and use this, uh, this pipe rifle that that super mutant dropped. Do a quick save real quick. Let's check the terminal first in case there's anything that we can disable. And it's the spotlights. So we'll go ahead and deactivate those just in hopes that it helps something. And, you know, it probably won't help much, but we do what we can. What is this? Flame refuel? I'll take that. Bottle cap. Let's take those. All right. So we quick saved. We're going to go up here. Okay. I thought this led to the roof. Maybe it... Hello? Alright. Maybe it doesn't, yeah. Maybe it just, uh... Because, you know, I saw people on the rooftop when I looked up at the building. I saw a person up there, but... Maybe the only way to get up there is to go through the front. So, the Saugus Ironworks is where we're going in this episode today. Aside from a, a fucking firefight that we had in front of the building. <clears throat> ah. I see. Um... Oh, did I leave any nuclear call here? Uh-oh. No. Okay. Bro, why would you sell us out like that? Oh my goodness. This is bad news, boys. And girls. No, no, no. I'm gonna need you to focus on who's right in front of us. How'd you miss that? Alright, do it one more time. You got it. Oh, shit. Another flamer fuel person. And they have a skull above their head? We're fucked. 
We are royally fucked. Let's slow down time again. I think I'm running out of jet. And I desperately need to use a stim pack. Eat some squirrel bits. I'm a little hungry. Um, see if I can like dodge any bullets. Yeah. Pro game remove. Pro strat. I missed. All right, I'm dead. You'll never get me alive. Wow, we are having ourselves a tough time. I am always thirsty on the go, man. You're gone. I'm jumping down here because that flame refuel person, they have it out for me. Please. Think about it. Think about it. Where'd you go? Think about it. I'm going outside. Nice. They'll never catch us now. Now that we have the outside on our side. I see. Hello. Wow. They are coming at me hard and fast. So, <clears throat> we're going to probably grab, I fuck, I don't know, this Molotov cocktail. We got some frag grenades. Throw one of these down. Eat shit. Bye. Yep, got a little head marker. Light this one up. Goodbye. I hope. Who is shooting at me? Please die. Oh, wow. Wait, check the Forge Keeper's body for information. What? Forge Keeper's note? Who is shooting me? Hello? All right. That's just a flamer, because everybody in this building has a fucking flamer. I see you over there. Die. Oh, I see you over there. Are you limping or something? No, you're stuck in place. I really... I, I'm assuming I'm getting shot from the rooftop. Uh, because that's the, oh, some new cola cherry. I love that shit. Um, I'm assuming I'm getting shot from the rooftop because I really have no idea. <clears throat> but my hope is I can kill everybody just enough. Please die. Oh, shit. Please die. I'm sorry about this. You knew the stakes when you were coming out here. And your limp tells me that you won't make it very far. And that's okay. Thank God. Now who the fuck is shooting at me? All I know is all these caravan folks are dead. You know what? Did they walk on my... I set those mines earlier. My hope is that they didn't walk on those. Because if they did, you know, rest in peace. Oh, wait, so what was this guy's name? The Keeper? The Forged Keeper? Why did he have... I guess this was like a side quest. I had no idea. Just was running in here just to be stupid and do whatever. Forged Keeper's note. We found a heavy incinerator off the bodies of the old military rem of some old military remnants. Didn't recognize the dog tags, but Slag was impressed with the quality of their gear. As for the incinerator, he says for this, this special... He says something this special requires a trial, a test to sort out the, me the metal from the ore. We had a few volunteers, but that doesn't surprise me. Most of these recruits don't have the nerve to walk through the fire, let alone the strength to survive it. Um, worse yet, I caught one of the cowards trying to cheat. I put the evidence in a toolbox by the terminals and stashed the key in one of the tin cans above it. I'll have Slag look over it uh, before we feed her to the forge. Okay. Did this activate, like, some sort of, um, like, optional little, like, side quest? Like, little miscellaneous side quest? Because I thought that there was... Or maybe it didn't. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it didn't. I mean, like, it did, but, like, it didn't, you know? Like, it started something. I'll take that. Yeah, I see you up there. Please, God, Jesus Christ. How the fuck did you hit me with that from all the way up there? We're going inside. And if I see you inside, 
You're dead. Save it real quick. I don't want to talk too much shit and then die. Yes, it is a little bit safe, scummy, but we got to do what we got to do. All right. What do you have? What is with everybody in this area having something related to fire? Like, I get that it's an ironworks, but come on, man. Do better. Although, so far, I know we just walked in. Ow. This is gonna be fun. First of all, you're dead. You feel stupid? You should. All right. Ow. Everywhere I go in this is just... I'm just getting hurt. Is that, is that Jet? I'll take that. It's only my favorite drug. And dog meat, you open this door for what? To ruin my safety? Alright, he's dead. Okay. That is a trap. But I don't know... Oh, hello. Oh, you know, we're going to go ahead and unlock this because Lord knows if there's some stim packs in here, they belong to me. There is. And... Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, we disarm that. Yeah. What is that? Is this alcohol or something? Yeah, whiskey. Day tripper. I take it. Okay. Now, my health is low, so I should probably fix that real quick before I get murdered trying to investigate further in here. Um, do a little rat away. Do a little stick pack. And cool. No sign of them now. It's me. I'm still here. You're just dumb and you haven't seen me yet. Are you up here? I don't see anything. Hello? Turn my light on. Oh, there's a whole other half to this building. Jesus Christ, it's huge. I thought this shit was way smaller. Hello? Oh, okay, there's a room right here. Ah, a robot. Now, we could turn on the Protectron. Can I do that? Oh, I have to unlock this? Can I do it first try? Let's see. Let's see. Is it food? No. Is it fang? No. Is it a pawn? Yes. Wow, look at us go. Look at us go. Activate unit. Powering up. You're going to help me. You're my new friend. What the fuck is an eco sack? I'll take it, but hello? Ow! How you doing? <laughs> All right, <clears throat> but now we've got that. We've got a little protector on to help us. Is that a? Oh, I thought that was a a, a bottle cap mine. I was about to get real hype. Nothing up here. Nothing over here. There's still someone in here actively hunting me down. Um, I doubt that I'll get this one on the first try, but we can give it a shot. Crates. A zero. All right, how about, uh, attend? Okay, not that either, huh? It has to be healed. Oof. Uh-huh. All right, give me a moment. I'm going to try to solve this real quick. All right, I finally got into it. It looks like it's, we can just use it to open the door next to it, uh, which is good. So I'll do that. That'll let us into the other side, it looks like. And there's probably people in here waiting, because I kept hearing voices. So I'm sure there's somebody in here that has something to say to me. Uh-huh. A shish kebab of people over there. Very good. Hello, dog meat. Why are you all the way up there? How did you get up there? Now, hold on. Did he run through here? Oh, I forgot you were here, buddy. Happy for you. Yeah, you ran over here. Now, why'd you come this way, dog me? Was there somebody over here? I don't see anybody. Did you just run over here to be cute? Because it worked. Aha. He's gone. Gonzo. Goner. Now, who the fuck threw that? Hello? You guys are relentless. I don't know where you're at. Oh, you're down here. Can I get a headshot? Zero chance of hit, huh? 
I'm sorry about this kid. Nothing personal. Just like a regular old can of goo gone. <laughs> There's a turret out here too? Oh, there is. It are belong to me. It's gone. This is another terminal unmarked. Oh. oh I guess this is those who failed the forge. Okay, people's names that I guess have died trying to get through the forge. I don't know why they would try to go through something like that, but hell. If they are into it, you know what I'm saying? Um, let's come down here. Because I don't think we've gone... We haven't gone to the bottom floor yet, but we also haven't gone to the rooftop. I absolutely melted your ass. You're fucking gone. This must be the forge. Yeah. Or one of them, anyway. Oh, no, here's the forge. Oh, there's a weapon. Is that a flamer? Oh, sad. Hmm. The question is, should I try it? Should I save it right here and go? We're going to do that. We're going to walk in here and grab it. <laughs> I should have expected nothing less. I see. So, like how? I wonder how they manage, like what, what the thought process is here. Like how do you get into that? I probably read it on a terminal. Oh. I probably read it on a terminal earlier, but just completely disregarded it because I'm the way that I am. Can I get inside of this? Enter. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Vector. How's, the, how's this armor looking? The top of it's looking good? Can I... Machinery crossing? Can I push this? Is that... Okay, it's not going to do anything. Alright. Can I walk in here now if I have a suit of armor on? How about now? Okay. The armor doesn't help either. So now we've learned. But, at least we're a little bit more protected with the suit of armor, uh, going against all these folks out here. Now, I remember reading in one of those notes that he said something about, like, uh... Oh, God, there's flamer fuel galore in here, and I'm tired of it. He was mentioning something about, like, a tin can, and, like, the, uh, the tin can had, like, a key in it for something. But I'm trying to figure out, like, what exactly he was talking about... Because obviously I can't get in here. Like, that is just... That is just a no-go. That looks just like a normal flamer, though. And I don't... I think I already have a flamer. So, like, why would I need another flamer? You know? So we're going to try to see if we can get to the roof and see if that helps. Or if there's an area that we missed in here that maybe I am simply overlooking. Because, okay. So here's where we shot the turret. Uh-huh. And there is a little bit more stuff up here. Okay. Got some more ammunition. What do we have over here? Some more. Just a little bit more ammunition. I'll take what I can get. That must lead to the roof. Or that leads to the roof. What is this? The blast furnace. That's probably where we need to go. Um, yeah. Let's go to the blast furnace room. See if we can figure something out. Help. Oh. Oh tries to leave kill him you must be pretty strong to make it here oh fuck <laughs> uh it was easy it was easy most of them were never going to be worth forging in the first place see jake here's someone who might actually be worth my time unlike you but you're going to kill me but i brought everything you asked for stealing things from your family farm doesn't prove your strength boy Though this wonderful sword you brought does put me in the mood to give you one last chance to prove your worth. What do you say? Kill that prisoner and prove that you aren't completely useless. You said we'd be waiting outside the Commonwealth. These people aren't even a threat to us. Prove to me that you can kill. It's him or you. Oh, God. What do I do? What do I do? Hmm. 
What should I tell him? Should I tell him to walk away or kill him? Please let me go. What's it gonna be, Jake? Oh, maybe I should just be sarcastic. Hmm. Walk away. To me walk that away. You're worth four, Jake. You don't have to do this. You're right. I don't want to do this. I don't want to join the forge. I just want to go home. Last chance, Jake. If you don't kill the prisoner before I count to three, well, it's over. All right, we're gonna go ahead and save it right here. <laughs> Y'all didn't see it coming, did you? You killed Jake! I don't even know who you are. I'm dead. Come on. I pressed the critical button. Do it. Do it! Do it. Do it. Oh, man, it took you long enough. Holy shit. Um... So, I didn't realize we were going to literally walk in on some shit going down. So, that kind of affects things a little bit. So, we're going to do rat away, rat X as usual. Wait, is this Jake? Did he survive? Jake survived. What a time to be alive. Oh my god. Sometimes I hate this game. Sometimes I truly... Sometimes I just don't get the appeal, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Why do you keep shooting at me? Can I leave? I can. You know... Oh boy. What are we going to do here? Now I have a shotgun, and if you're gonna be right here in my face... I'm sorry about this slag, but truly I'm not. You guys watch my health for me. I'm just kidding. Oh my god, Jake! What a king. We'll get slag eventually. As you can see, he's a bullet sponge. And I'm putting in all of the bullets that I can into this man because I had no idea he was up here. Um, he's gone. He's no longer a threat to us, Jake. You're, you're a dummy, bro. Goodbye. Oh, wait, wait, goodbye. What is this? Glow, wait, get the fuck out of my way. Glow sided hair trigger shotgun? I'll take that. Wow. We've done. Oh, there's a fucking. Whoa, what's this? It's a right leg, huh? Where's my right leg? Oh, but mine's the one that slows down time if I'm 20% less health. Okay, but what's this? 10 and 5, and then we have 4 and 7. I'll probably leave it the way it is. Just keep that one. Nice. Got his sword. Um, the roof key. Does this man have... Um, what was I missing? The legs? Legs. Leg. Cool. Because then I should be able... I don't know how to put those on this, though. I probably have to actually like find a station and put them on. Ooh, nice. Um, cool. Let me talk to you, though. <clears throat> wait, wait. I'm sorry. I, I messed up. I panicked. Always happy to help. I don't know what I was thinking trying to join them. Look, I, I should probably try to go home and make amends. I know I've got no right to ask, but I bet if you're there to explain, things with my dad would go easier. I bet if you bring my great-granddad's sword, he he'll make it worth your while. He always tries to deal fair with people. I'll wait for you by the overpass near the farm. All right. <clears throat> well, we uh, unintentionally found a side quest, um, which is fine. Uh, I don't mind. But it does not mean we're going to stop. Sad. It does not mean we're going to stop exploring the area, though. Make sure we're not missing anything down here. A lot of skeletons down here. Uh huh. Okay. Very good. Um, I, you know, it really seems like we really haven't missed much um, coming down here. However, he did give me a key to the roof, <clears throat> which is good. Um, now, based on the little icon on the left, does that mean my left arm or my right arm is busted? I'll just take all of it. And then whenever we get to another station to repair, then I will simply fix it. Oh, he has a terminal up here. 
Hello? Maybe, maybe, no. Hmm. The question is, is should I read it? Does slag matter that much? Maybe. Does this even lead to the roof? Oh, it does. I think. No, it doesn't. How about this? Okay, aluminum canister. You have a hammer in your skull, sir. That's a shame. But I think the way that we came in, yeah, I think the door actually leads to the outside. So I think we might head that way. Is that a stim pack? Oh, we fucking in this shit. We doing it. Ugh. Thank ya. Alright, cool. Let's try to unlock this again just while we're walking by it. Maybe we'll lock out. Come on, come on. No. Alright, fine. One more time. We'll see if we can get it. No. <clears throat> Alright. You guys lucked out. If I wasn't going to unlock it this time, I was just going to leave. Um... Pause. Hannah just walked in. Hannah? So, funnily enough, uh, whenever I said Hannah got here, my girlfriend actually walked in from work, and uh, I actually like quit Fallout for the rest of the day. I actually played this yesterday, and uh, now I'm trying to pick up where I left off uh, because uh, she came in and we started talking and hanging out, and I completely forgot about completing the recording. So now here I'm back, just kind of completing this area where we were before. We were at this terminal, um, and I was going to start reading kind of through these, because we just killed, I think it was Slag is what his name was, because uh, we just kind of walked up on him. Um, but starting with the first one that's called Weak, it says, Weak recruits so far, they break instead of honing to the edge. May have to abandon operations in the Commonwealth altogether, unless we uncover a better source. And then we have Progress, which is... Met some of our neighbors, call themselves the Gunners. Stronger, sharper, convinced a few to attempt the trials. They passed, and now they're the Forged. Uh, their leaders weren't pleased, but there was some blood. But when, we, when they saw our resolve, they chose to negotiate. Wise. Now word has gotten around about the gang that beat the Gunners. Lots of new recruits. Seems we'll be staying in the Commonwealth after all. We have materials, which is scrap shipments from Dunwich borers have halted. Sent Bedlam to light the fire under the worms. <clears throat> All right, this one's called Jake. Another flawed candidate attempts to bribe his way in, but the blade he gave is impressive. I'll give him, a I'll give him the trials, even if he fails. I'll still have something to show for it. And that's the guy we actually saved, like the little guy from the side quest that ran out. And then Corvega is Jared and his crew are dead. No surprise. Doubt he was even sober enough to enjoy the fight. Cool. All right. Now, I want to say, yeah, we were trying to find our way to the roof. And I think we can still do that. Because I think I can hop down here and go through this door. Is it a gun? Nice. Um, and then we can go through this door down here and go check out the rooftop and see... If we are, because I know there's a couple enemies up there, but I just also want to see if we're missing anything. And then I know we also grabbed, like, some extra armor pieces. So, yeah, so I can probably set this here. Can I just get out of this right now? Yeah. So we can actually add, like, the... Let me see. Yeah, because I think I was going to replace, like, virtually everything, because I have... Yeah, because I don't even have a right leg on this one. And I don't have a left leg on this one. And I have a left and right arm. But I think I was going to take... Oops. Which one did I just take? Oh, I took the leg. I'm stupid. Um, Alright, so we have the... Oh, they're both the same, though. How am I going to tell these things apart? Um, okay, so this one's almost broken, actually. And then this one... Right arm. Do I have a left arm? I do. Right down here. Oh, but the health is diminished. So let's put this left arm on. Cool. Now that we have a full suit of armor, not that it's like very great, but it's, it's okay. Um, we'll jump inside this. We'll go check out the roof, and then that should finish up this area. I don't think there's anything else here for us to kind of see, unless there's something up here that I'm missing. Let's check it out. See what's going on up here on the rooftop. 
Wow, I'm already almost level 18. This is incredible. What the hell was that? Oh. What the fuck was that? Hello? They're up here, I think. Yeah. Uh oh. Now, how are you gonna hurt my leg? I just got here, bro. Alright. Just gonna kinda check out these little areas while we're walking around. Oh, someone else has a fucking flamethrower. I heard that shit. Hello? Oh, they're all they're all down there burning themselves alive. Mostly because dog meat's fucking around and finding out, but you know, I'll let him do his thing. Oh, hello there! Wow. I thought that wearing this uh, this suit was going to make me strong enough to fuck with everybody up here. And I see that we're going to have a little bit of trouble. So we're going to go ahead and use a Stimpak. Maybe two. And let's go ahead and... I can't use that at all. We'll just go ahead and... Yeah, we'll just... Yeah. Oh, this is so good. Yeah, we'll do that. And what's up here? Do we got anything? Oh, just some ammo. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take what I can get. It doesn't look like there's anything up... Hello? It doesn't look like there's anything right up there, so I think this is literally the top. Who's shooting at me? Oh, y'all are shooting from over there! What is going on? We ain't even there. Oh. Goodbye. Well, I'm glad I at least have this suit on because uh, it is protecting me a little bit. So we can come around here and kind of... Because I didn't go through here and check anything out. Although there's probably not much up here, if anything at all. Was there a trap in there? Is that what I saw? Uh-huh. And what is this? Flamethrower trap. Okay, all right. That's all that was in here. It was a trap. They just wanted me to come in here and get fucked. That's all they wanted. And that's all right. But let me get this guy real quick. How you doing? Oh, sorry. Cool. I want to say that we've done it. Because I don't think there's really anything else up here. Oh, hold on. There's this little room right here. And there's nothing really. There's nothing here. Cool. Someone's still shooting at me, and I think it's from that little, uh, that little, like, walkway over there that we just looked at. Someone is shooting, like, a rocket launcher at me from a distance or something. Oof. Hello? Is there someone on the ground? There is! Oh, it's an Assault Tron! What the fuck? Alright, well, here's the thing. Assault Trons, they're kind of fucking assholes, so I'm not... I'm gonna see if I can get a distance away from it. Let's find out... Hmm... Well... I'm sure I can just go back inside here and it should kind of, like, deactivate that. Is what I'm thinking. But, hey bud, you can see all the red dots on my fucking radar down there, there's so many. But, this is probably, even though we're like in an attack stance, this is where I'm going to call this episode, uh, so we can kind of just continue by going up and through here next time, so we can kind of go out here, maybe go to the right or left and go find another area of interest. But, until then... Thank you for sticking around for this episode if you have, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.